In this stoichiometry problem, we'll be completing a mole-to-mole -mole conversion. Australia is the top producer of aluminum ore. Another name for that type of ore is called bauxite. The following reaction is an important step in the production of aluminum metal. Aluminum hydroxide reacts to make aluminum oxide plus water. Of course, we'll have to balance the reaction. What these coefficients mean, remember, are moles. So two moles of aluminum hydroxide are required to make one mole of aluminum oxide. And in that process, three moles of water will also be produced. OK, let's look at this question. If 5.5 moles of aluminum hydroxide react, how many moles of water will be produced? Let's follow the mole-to-mole -mole template. We'll start with a given, then a conversion factor, and then after carrying out the calculation, that will give us the goal or the answer. So the given is the information that's given to us in the problem. And that is 5.5 moles of aluminum hydroxide. The conversion factor, of course, that comes from the balanced equation. Now the given is aluminum hydroxide and the goal is moles of water. So our conversion factor should be between the given and the goal. The given is aluminum hydroxide and the goal is water. So our conversion factor will be 2 to 3. Now because we have moles of aluminum hydroxide down here, we'll also need moles of aluminum hydroxide down here. Notice that we didn't pick one mole of aluminum hydroxide, we picked two because two is the coefficient from the balanced equation. And three moles of water goes in the numerator. So carry out the computation on your calculator, and you would get 8.25 moles. This number has two sig figs. And these numbers, these are counting numbers. These are an infinite number of, two, of sig figs. So the fact that this has two sig figs limits our answer to a number with two sig figs. We've just completed a mole-to-mole -mole conversion.